Why do people park places where there's no parking signs? Clearly stating there's no parking allowed there. I don't know. Maybe because it's too cold out for them to walk from the parking space two feet away. Or they just don't care that those signs are there for a reason. Like at the Irving. The place is plastered with no parking signs and even has orange cones in the parking lot with no parking symbols on them. And some people still park in between the pumps and the store. When they do so, they block off the access to the pumps and limit the sight of the outside. Who cares if there's no one at the lonely pumps or in the quiet store? Doesn't mean you get to be treated like a king and pull your rig up in front of the store on the sidewalk. Also, buying a pack of smokes doesn't just take a second. It takes two minutes, which is enough time for someone to pull up outside to get gas, but can't because some dummy pulled, parked the rig in between the store and the pumps on an angle. It's simple. If it says no parking, don't park there. Now don't get me wrong, there are some places where it seems completely pointless to have no parking signs, but they're obviously there for a reason, just like the ones at the Irving, simply because it affects the flow of customers in and out of the store. Also, the doors to the store don't close on their own. So when you park your rig out front, the fumes sneak in through the cracks in the door and it simply sucks and smells. And just remember, even because you speed up the pace and say you'll hurry, doesn't change the fact that I'm already ticked off of you because I already asked you to move your vehicle and you didn't do it. Also, then you get them people who park their big rigs out front, like SUVs and huge trucks, the U-Haul vans, RVs. It blocks off the side of the pumps, and when we're sitting there, we can't see people pumping gas. For all we know, they could be smoking a cigarette or their car could be running, and everything could just go kaboom. That would suck. What if someone was in a hurry to get gas, and they came flying in the parking lot doing 80, not realizing there was a vehicle parked on an angle in between the pumps? Then your two vehicles will collide, be smashed, you'd be vehicleless, and it'd all be your fault for not obeying the law and reading the signs out front. That would be a total disaster. What do you think? The pump's going to move around your vehicle to be able to have enough access to pump gas in the other car? I don't think so. So why not? Just open your eyes, look for the signs, and simply just don't park there.